Good evening. We begin tonight with breaking news. I'm Marlette Youssef. And I'm Vinci Barra. The Arizona territorial era law banning nearly all abortions has been reinstated. This after a Pima County judge ruled to lift the injunction on it, placed after Roe v. Wade went into law in 1973. The near total ban was first enacted in 1912. It bans almost all abortions except for those where a mother's life is in danger. It came into question after the Roe v. Wade ruling was essentially overturned this year. Another Arizona law signed earlier this year by Governor Doug Ducey would have banned abortions after 15 weeks, but now, after this new ruling today, the old 1901 law is set to take effect. And reaction is coming in from both sides of the aisle. Senator Mark Kelly released the following statement. This decision will have a devastating impact on the freedom Arizona women have had for decades to choose an abortion if they need one. Let's be clear, this is exactly what Blake Masters wants, to completely ban abortions in Arizona and across the country without even an exception for rape or incest. I will never stop fighting to restore these rights for Arizona women. And Attorney, Mark, or Attorney General Mark Brenovich also released a statement in favor of this decision. He says a Pima County judge lifted an injunction that was placed on Arizona's abortion statute. We applaud the court for upholding the will of the legislature and providing clarity and uniformity on this important issue. I have and will continue to protect the most vulnerable Arizonans, he says. And Planned Parenthood is also chiming in. The organization says today. Today's ruling by Pima County Superior Court has the practical and deplorable result of sending Arizonans back nearly 150 years. No archaic law should dictate our reproductive freedom and how we live our lives today.